I could not sleep last night, John. Why oh, not, Dave? What's mate, going on? It's like today's like Christmas for me because uh, yeah. it's the thirty first of August. That's right. We've been waiting for this day for a long time. And the new Angels album's Woo! out. Take it to the streets yes. this very day. So what I've done is I've got John Brewster oh, okay. from the Angels, hello, one of the founding <laughs> member of the Angels, to come in and spend the day with us. Welcome, John. Thanks for coming on the show. Uh, it's a great pleasure, and it's uh, very exciting times. Mm. Yeah, yeah, very exciting. I, was, uh, I actually did. I, I was SMSing you last night. I yeah. can't sleep. I was like. <laughs> A swimmer before oh, uh, before the hundred meters. Beep, beep, beep. <laughs> oh, never mind. Well, it is an exciting day, and uh, well, tell us just quickly what, what's in store for this album, guys. It's uh, look, it's an album that um, we're very excited about. There's a lot of spontaneity on it. Um, we just had such a vibe in the studio, and um, and and it's come to this. And, and and I'm proud to say that we mixed it in Adelaide up at Mixmaster Studio with Mick Wordley, cool. uh, who is I think he's sensational. Great studio, and in fact, if you walk into the playing room uh, where the drums are, and you look up on this big shelf there, the, there are the speakers that we used to stand be- between um, at Albert Studio, mm-hmm. King Street, back in the seventies. <laughs> wow, there you go. he's got them, and and I just it was got, meant to be. It was we meant used to, to have happen. those things cranked <laughs> like you wouldn't believe. <laughs> For anyone who gets out there and gets the album, take it to the streets early. There's uh, a limited edition of uh, some live stuff that we did in Queensland earlier on in the year at the Q Pack uh, up there. So I don't I don't like to display my own trumpet, <laughs> oh, but it we. sounds bloody awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Triple M and the Rock of Ages with Dave Gleeson, and we're hanging out with John Brewster today. Why, Dave? Well, because the new Angels album, Take It to the Streets, T-I-T-T-S, mm. which would be the abbreviation of that, <laughs> is out now, the 31st of August. I can't believe we're here. It's, but it's one of those things that took a long time mm. for the last month to, uh, to to transpire, but here we are. Look at you. You're so excited. <laughs> <laughs> I'm on the other side of the, Me too. Uh, the mic now. <laughs> Now, every band's got a song that they need to uh, to have played before they mm-hmm. go on stage. I think Metallica's is Let There Be Rock. John, what about yours? What's your song you need to have be played before you go on? LaGrange. LaGrange? Yeah, I just think LaGrange is just one of those great... It's a fantastic example of simplicity. Yep. It's the simplest thing in the world, you know, and it's one of the greatest rock tracks ever, you know, the, just, the, just the take they did in that studio... It just lives and it always will. And did the Angels work with Terry Manning from ZZ Top? Yeah, they did, but I wasn't in the band okay. at the time, but uh, apparently they, it was a great experience. And I've met, I've met Terry, but I uh, never worked with him, and I'd love to. There you go. So there's a little mm. tie-in with everything, isn't there? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Especially but the more that people track, you know. Le- LaGrange is just incredible, you know. What a riff. And if you listen to it, LaGrange doesn't have any other real part mm. in it, does it? Except no. that the lead break. It's just no. the same groove all the way through. Cool as. But it's, you know, it's a great example of simplicity. You know, that's what George Young used to teach us. Keep it simple.